Hi Taurus, welcome to your weekend love readings. These will be from the 8th until the 10th of May. If you are in Australia and you are a mum, happy Mother's Day this weekend. It is Mum's Day, Mum's Day, Mother's Day <laughs> on Sunday. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment down in the comment section below. These are general love readings, so they're not going to resonate with every single person every single week. That's all right. If it's not resonating with you this weekend, hit that notification button if you haven't already, and then go and check out one of the other tarot readers here on YouTube. Now, if you're new to the channel, welcome. These are the weekend readings, which means they're a much shorter format. Longer format come out on a Sunday and a Monday night. So make sure again that you've hit that notification button so you don't have to keep track of the time zones. All right, love messages. Let's go for my Taurians. Taurus. Taurus, Taurus, Taurus. Taurus. Queen of Wands in reverse, Taurus. Okay. Hmm. Chariot. Could be dealing with a cancer here or another fire sign. Knight of Cups. Okay. Uh, Taurus, I think you're feeling quite overwhelmed at which at the speed of which someone is coming at you or a situation is progressing. Um, Queen of Wands here. Queen of Wands in reverse. She's in reverse, which means she's got too much going on. It's like there's too much happening and then it's happening really fast and I don't know what to do and it's freaking me out. Um, Queen of Wands, please. Thank you. Okay, you may actually be also afraid of what other people are going to think because of how quickly this is moving. Um, other people's opinions might be what's overwhelming you. Everyone having a say about, you know, your business. I hate that. That annoys me. Tell them to mind their own business. Yeah, it's very stressful for you. Okay. So I think there's a lot of people passing judgment on what's going on in your relationship, causing you a lot of stress, causing you sleepless nights. Um, part of you may also be a little bit overwhelmed by how quickly this is moving, but let's get a sense of what's really going on. What's the Knight of Cups here, please? I have something on the connection between this person and the Knight of Cups. Okay. Well, what they're, they're giving you is the truth. Like whatever they're telling you, the you know, your person, not these people, um, you know, if they're confessing love to you, if they're saying they want to be with you forever, if they're saying that you're the only one for them, they're actually being honest and upfront about it. Um I think that they're just very blunt and they're no nonsense. They're just like, yep, I know. When you know, you know, so let's just get on with it. Um, they're not someone that messes around. Four of Pentacles, they don't want to lose you. They absolutely know. They're very clear in their mind what they want and they want to hold on to this. Anything on the chariot, please? Anything on the chariot? Could be a cancer, water sign, fire sign. Doesn't have to be. Okay, so you may also be, I think, part of the overwhelming part, like I said, you might be a bit nervous about it, and that is because you're thinking back to the past. What if I get hurt again like I have been in the past? Absolutely normal feelings everyone feels in any relationship, no matter how quickly it's going. Um, so, yeah, don't, you know, don't be freaking out because of that. That's a normal thought process. Do what feels right. Most likely outcome here, please. For Taurus. Ooh, that's weird. Ten of Cups in reverse. So I think it might be the people that you're actually living with or are in your immediate environment closest to. That's who you're disagreeing with. That's who's passing judgment. And it's causing tension in your household, tension in your immediate circle of friends potentially. Um, it's the environment. It's not making you feel good. Four of, Wands, four of Swords. It's very stressful. There's a lot of stress here going on. It might even be making you a little bit sick. All you want to do is kind of be kind and giving and caring and 
yeah, you just want your four of wands and that's where you're headed. So don't let these people get to you because I think you're going to go ahead and offer that pentacle anyway or accept the pentacle anyway, either way, doesn't matter, which is, you know, the upgrade from the cup because the cup is the, I don't know, the engagement the pentacle is the ring so um yeah not only do you have the the you receive giving and receiving this pentacle as the queen it's very closely followed by the four of wands which is this union marriage um you know in, increase in relationship status that sort of thing like a relationship upgrade here so it all seems perfectly legit don't let these people get to you um, most likely up. Uh, sorry, advice. We already did outcome advice, please, for Taurus. Okay, so you need to take care of your health, Taurus. You're not looking after your health, and it's come up twice. So that's a big red flag for me. Um, you need to be taking better care of yourself. A card. Okay, that's good advice. One more. Okay. <laughs> All right. I, this is referring back to these. This is family and friends fighting. Like that is the actual meaning of this card in reverse. <laughs> so um, like you're fighting with your family and friends or close family and friends. Again, having to hear things that may be hurt or that you don't want to hear. Um, and Spirit saying, listen, don't totally discount that. Consider them. Think about them. Work out what is relevant and what isn't relevant um, because they're in amongst all of this they may actually have some valid points that are worth consideration with this hermit worth reflecting on that's what he does he reflects and then he learns and he takes his lessons and then he applies them so you may actually have some lessons to learn in some of this feuding that's going on I feel like it's at like you know in a cartoon where you get a picture of a cloud as they're all fighting that's what this is to me um so there are things to be learned in that it's not all just to be ignored and then separately you need to be taking care of yourself you need to be getting more rest you need to be um being aware of you know your health conditions if you've got any because they're under pressure at the moment Romance Angel, please. I think that the key is they're saying these things because they mean well. They're not doing it because they don't care about you. Calling in your soulmate. That is, and this is why it's kind of unnatural to everyone else, but for you two, it feels so right because you're soulmates and not everyone understands that connection, particularly if they haven't experienced it themselves. So, um, you know, your prayers, affirmations and visual, visualizations <laughs> help bring you together. So that's amazing news. That's what's happening over here in the Four of Wands. I'm so excited for you. It's a happily ever after scenario. It's beautiful. All right, Taurus, that's what I've got for you this weekend. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment down in the comment section below and I will see you back here for the weekly reads. Talk to you then. Bye.